Today is the last mentoring session for Cronenberg 1664 La Pretty Fashion Award. Today is going to be extremely interesting and hectic for all the nine contestants. Everyone has to bring their five outfits, whether it's complete or non-completion, doesn't matter, it's very important for them to bring in because today they have to fit their models. So it will be um, interesting to see how the outfits fits on the model and they will have a great experience doing, doing uh, that. Um, and also today they have to collaborate and talk about their hair and makeup. So the hair is going to be the team from L'Oreal and the makeup is from Diva Production. So can you imagine today they will have a very full day and myself too. Is pure evil. Am I right? Correct. Yes. Yeah. So you look at the um, the whole collection is really dramatic. So we discuss. We are dis we're going to discuss now the makeup first, and then the hair. She she really wants to look like evil. Like at first we will talk about like this type. You can have five different hair and you, you, you know, go into a talent, you cut it, you know, edge it that way or you want it to be really, you know, sharp. It has to be sharp edges, so five different wigs. You look at my hair, it's very good. <laughs> because it's a wig, so you can play a, a, a lot with it, you know, it can be shorter one side, long. My advice is you seriously need to focus. You have great concept, you have great drawings. You have to use back the same material, isn't it? This is much softer than this. Look, the color. You, you can even put a bird in there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. They have all this, uh, you know, bird and then flower inside, all, and, uh, all the, all the feathers. Yeah. Okay, back to your collection. I mentioned this bustier needs more effort, right, Alice? Like I said, your initial drawing. So beautiful, amazing, you know, and then you come up with this first piece. We chose you is because of this intricate lace combination with PVC or leather. You are using real leather, you know. I actually expected the jacket to be like a pea coat. I guess this is difficult because you are not a men's designer and the men's cutting. Yeah, the body is oversized, but the sleeve is not oversized enough. This is the original piece, right? Mm. Somehow, from the beginning, I didn't really like this patching. I mean, I, I don't mind the patching, but I just don't like the, the color. color. You still have something here, or it's, it's, it's like this? Uh, Hollow. I think there's a organza. And you Long still sleeve. have? Yeah. Oh, here. A cool tone. The, the very difficult to do kind of a skeleton boning. Very edgy, you know, the glossy yes, yes, yes. blue. A different model. You see, this one in, like I said, it's the same texture hair, but in a different shape. Eco is a bit wavy. Eco is round. Ce n'est juste qu'une question de temps. Oh, le temps. Hi, Poana. Loosen up. <laughs> I'm not gonna eat you up. <laughs> okay. So now you're finally you got five of them. The punk tease up hair and then this. I think both sides will be quite nice. Then you'll do a little go, a little tie. 
Anyway, it's not finished, you know, everything will have this alien-like. But do you still have all these things here? Yeah, yeah you still, right? Because okay. I need to... I, the... I don't know about this red pants. <laughs> Well, we'll fit on the model and then we talk about it, yeah? My collection called Cosmodo. Huh? Yeah, but my inspiration from Notre Dame. Your collection is called what? Cosimodo. Cosimodo is Japanese. The story from the... Yeah, uh, I, I don't know which is... Cosimodo. Okay, Cosimodo. Okay. Inch out, straight down. Thank you.